Hi everybody, this is CT Readings and hi Cancer. Let's see what messages will show up for you guys now. What do we have for Cancer, please? What are the messages that want to show up for Cancer? I will be linking the reading about your person underneath the video if you're interested um, to watch that. Like I said, it will be linked below. So let's have a look. What do we have for Cancer, please? We have success. I know that there's no greater goal than to love. Oh my goodness. And we have change at the bottom of the deck. So this tells me that something is about to change for you and there is major success in something. So if you have something going on, that you know you're focused on currently at the present moment i definitely feel like it's gonna bring you a lot of success there's also something home related family related okay i see expansion in that okay but let's have a look What do we have for cancer? All right, we have release your ex. There's something that you need to let go of energetically. Um, it is troubling you when you think about it. It makes you feel a certain type of a way. So there's a need for you to release somebody from your energy, okay? Show me more for Cancer. children some of you may have a child with somebody okay and then we have give your relationship a chance it's either that you have a child with somebody or you're focused on a child or it is that somebody in the past has uh, behaved in a very childish way with you okay um, the thing is that with the give your relationship a chance I kind of feel like there is somebody who still wants to fix things with you maybe who previously was acting very immature okay oopsie so they might come back around or you might be wanting to you know fix things too but you're kind of like you know what it's i'm not going to be putting in enough effort towards this anymore okay for a lot of you i feel like recently it's it's been like there's a lot of like spiritual messages coming through okay some of you could be learning or it's like tough lessons recently that you've learned i kind of feel like there's something that happened in your life recently cancer in the past i would say four to five weeks that completely transformed something for you okay um let's see what do we have for cancer please we have page of pentacles knight of pentacles six of cups and the chariot there you go a lot of you are focused on something money related work related okay um but i kind of feel like you are taking it one day at a time there is a lot of perseverance in your energy cancer okay it's almost like i i feel like you're very patient with something uh you've made up your mind to achieve something and you are working towards it there could even be something new that you're doing okay there's a lot of like determination and listening to your intuition kind of an energy a lot of you are headed towards some sort of a good news or success um 
with the six of cups energy i'm kind of getting that there is somebody from the past now i'm getting cancer that it's not just this person who thinks about you i feel like you also think about this person quite often okay um yeah i feel like you also think about them it's not just them for sure We have the devil. Oh my goodness. Two of cups. The strength. Okay. Now, one thing I am seeing here, Cancer, for you is that there is a deep connection that you and somebody share. Um, it's hard for you to separate yourself from this person even though I feel like in the 3D or in the physical realm you guys are not really communicating or like not right really in each other's face but it almost looks like you are telepathically um, connected to somebody yes okay I'm really getting that there's somebody that you are telepathically connected to um, I feel like with this person there are differences I don't know if it's like a cultural difference or it's like something is different about you and them you could be just completely different individuals but again you know even if you guys are different it's like something is uniting you two still okay You know, despite the fact that there are differences, something is bringing you two together. Um, then we have the strength card. This talks about being strong, being about, you know, this is about inner courage. Um, I feel like this relationship, this situation, Cancer, it used to bother you really bad, but it doesn't bother you as much. And with the strength card, I kind of feel like you've made peace with something, okay? But the thing is that it's not like you have completely like detached from somebody, but you've made peace with the situation, which means that, you know, you have other things in your life that you're focused on. I kind of feel like this person does want to come back around. Okay, show me something about this person for cancer. Look at that, Hierophant and the Death card with the Four of Pentacles and the Six of Wands. Cancer, this is somebody who wants your attention or who does want to make the situation right with you. But currently, I kind of feel like this is somebody who's not speaking to you. But again, you know, don't... It, it almost looks like this person is silent, but it's not like they're silent because they're forgotten about you or they don't want you or something. They, oopsie. <laughs> they're silent because... It's like for some of you, this person's focused on their life. There's something going on with them as well emotionally, you know. 
you know, especially with the energies around us all at this present time, Cancer, this person is going through a transformation, like not in regards to you just, but in regards to what's going on in their life as well. So that's why they're taking their time. But at the end of the day, I kind of feel like you guys are going to connect with one another again. Um, I'm really not seeing that this is somebody who has any malicious intent, but it does look like they're working on themselves or they're realizing things and you're very much like on their mind. It's not like there's somebody who has forgotten about you. What is the outcome of the situation? You have the hangman and the magician card. I feel like... Um, I want one more card. Show me one more. King of Cups to the Tower. Now, the thing is that when I was pre-shuffling, I kept seeing the King of Cups for you, Cancer. Like, I kept seeing it. Um, so, to me, it looks like with the Hangman and the Magician, you're definitely manifesting some form of a change here, okay? Um, pay attention to what you're thinking about these days. Something very spiritual here, okay? Some of you could be getting very vivid dreams as well. I feel like recently there's something that happened in your life, Cancer, that made you feel like it, it really like, oh my goodness, like energetically it just tore you apart, okay? But I kind of feel like with the hangman and the magician, you're picking yourself back up and it's like whatever seems stuck or previously it seemed very stuck in the energy, I feel like it's going to get moving again, okay? So it's like things are picking up pace for you again, kind of an energy, okay? But the Four of Cups can represent discontent, boredom, um, you know, not really being aware, being sad, okay? There's, again, you know, I feel like there's a need for you to wake up to something, you know, a lot of you need to stay in the present moment because there's like, you're looking back at a situation that is just not there, A, and B, apparently, you know, to me, it looks like that Four of Cups energy is very, like, it's a very vague energy where somebody's trying to find answers. They look back and they're like, oh, why did it happen that way? Why did it happen this way? But Six of Swords, you know, this person or you, I feel like it's you, you have the awareness that this is something that just doesn't serve me anymore, okay? Um, and with the Ace of Wands, this is telling you to follow your passion, you know. There's something on your mind that you really want to create. Some of you are very creative. Maybe your work is, you know, something related to art or architecture or um, I'm getting illustrations or, uh, you know, what is that? Like something artsy that you guys do. Um, focus more on that, okay? Even if you're not a very artsy person, it's just I just feel like there is something that you want to create, you want to manifest. And, you know, this reading is telling you to redirect your energies towards that more. More so than being discontent and bored about something and then, you know, being like, oh, maybe tomorrow. Okay, so there's this energy of, I would say procrastination. Okay, not, yeah, not a wands, being passionate, you know, it's about finding your motivation. Okay, that's it, um, Cancer. Those were the messages that showed up for you. Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and check out the extended link below if you would like. Take care and bye-bye.